We are a much better school district than we were 10 months ago. We have done that as a team. Polio knows he'll be interviewed by Interim Education Commissioner Wayne Lewis. He says he's looking forward to discussing the progress JCPS has made since he took over as superintendent. We have to show up and do the work. No, ma no matter what anybody says, we have to show up and do the work. And I believe we are doing that. Polio outlined a number of successes he says the district has seen over the last 10 months, including a reorganization of administrative positions, saving half a million dollars. Wednesday morning, the interim commissioner walked through the parking lot of the Van Hoos Education Center, getting his first look of JCPS. Glad to be here. Um, had the opportunity to start my day talking with kids, and so that's always a really start. good start to the day for me. Lewis wouldn't go into specifics of what he's looking for during his visit. The Kentucky Department of Education called for a comprehensive audit after a review showed concerns with the district's leadership and management. Lewis says he's seen the audit but wanted to visit the district for himself. He will then decide whether to recommend a state takeover, state assistance, or no action. The process is ongoing, as I've said before. Um, I do have every expectation that I will make a decision and make that recommendation to the Kentucky Board of Education by the end of the month. Now, when I talked to Superintendent Marty Polio last night, he says he's met the interim commissioner before. He says Wayne Lewis visited Doss High School when Polio was principal there. At this point, we know Lewis is set to interview a number of JCPS officials and board members. He'll also visit two schools, but hasn't said which ones. Emily Maha, WLKY News.